You know, I've been uh, advising companies uh, over the years about how to run their businesses more successfully, and I hear from people on my website all the time about, well, you got this uh, big company, Mark, and we don't know how to access you, and we don't know if you're really somebody who's interested in talking to me about my small business or large business or mid-sized business or whatever the hell size of business is. But the truth is, I'm interested in talking to everybody about their businesses. And I needed to make that point clearer, so I'm beginning to make that point now to you. Uh, I'm really passionate about how people grow companies. I've been an entrepreneur my whole life. That's what really excites me, seeing companies grow out of nothing or a significant size company grow to the next level or a big company grow bigger than it was before or a company in trouble turning things around. And in fact, I, and I also feel right now that we're at war. I mean, I feel like all of us in the business community are at war because, first of all, the marketplace is very competitive. It's always been that way. It's never been easy to be successful in business. So you have a war in your hands. You can't just make this a hobby. When I see people fail, it's because they are hobbyists. The ones who recognize it's a war, a positive, exhilarating war, they're the ones who win, and I want to help you win that war. We can do it together. And, in fact, I've got a, a brand-new uh, radio show uh, on WABC in New York, the flagship station of ABC Radio, starting tomorrow on Saturday, July 17th at uh, 4 o'clock, WABC 770 AM. Tune in if you want to listen to the show. We'll probably have podcasts of it, etc. as we move forward. Um, you can even, uh, if you look below this, uh, you can even see uh, a link to uh, a segment of the show that I just uh, already pre-recorded with uh, the president of the American Enterprise Institute, I think a really good one, who has got a new book out called The Battle. So we're in a battle. I think we're in a war. He thinks we're in a battle. It's the same kind of thing, right? We're also, I think, believe it or not, I believe that all of us who are in the business community right now are enemies of the state. Um, the administration in Washington wants to penalize us for being successful, wants to stop us from being successful, wants us to all work for the post office. We don't want to work for the post office. We want to run out companies. So I also want to be able to give you advice on things like how do you fire that person who's causing a cancer in your company? How do you use marketing to get to the next level? How do you make yourself a better leader, better manager? These are the questions among many that I'll work on with you and offer you ways to uh, avail yourself if you're so interested in the uh, knowledge that I have and how I can help you in a number of ways, which you'll be seeing on my blog and on my website, etc. And now the blog's got a new format as well. But we'll be telling you how you can access the knowledge that I've got and my ability to share that with you to help you take your company to the next level in this wartime. So if this is a war, this is my dispatch of the week, and there'll be one every week. Dispatches, think about it, think about it as a dispatch from the front lines. Of course, we're all on the front lines. And I, every week I'll be providing other dispatch that I hope will be helpful to you in managing and growing your companies. I like to talk about business uh, in the media because it helps all of us be more successful by uh, building awareness of what it is to be entrepreneurs and, and those who work in, in companies of all sizes. I just did uh, Fox News' Neil Cavuto show this week talking about Toyota, a great brand that's now in serious trouble. So these are the kind of issues that I like to talk about and wrestle with all the time. Do you agree with me? Do you think business is war? Do you think we are enemies of the state? Do you need help on certain things? Post your comments right on a link below and we will uh, engage in a... Uh, in a constructive, collaborative, and perhaps sometimes adversarial uh, uh, discussion.